friends today i'm talking about uh, going to talk about facial massage all my life i have lived in india especially in bangalore and mumbai i love my country uh, now i'm living in houston i live in america but i miss my friends who are in india this video is dedicated to all my friends who live in india for the love they have shown to me and also to the people who live in us so many friends i have here also one thing that i want to say that i love my country i miss my friends and everything about that and i also love us because us is a country which is very clean everywhere i love the country's cleanliness the attitude towards the cleanliness which i love the most so let me talk about what i learned from india what i learned from us so many things all my life i have been using herbal things on my face so that i don't get wrinkles and all so today i thought i will talk about some facial massage techniques the best techniques and the methods that are used uh, i i would love to uh, share my secrets and share my techniques today so let me tell you take any oil or any moisturizer to your face and first apply the moisturizer or oil of any thing that you are comfortable with or anything that i you love you apply it to the face and one of the best technique i am going to tell you it's always the motion of your hands should be upward and outward because because of the gravitational force most of the time our skin st start to sag down so we have to pull it up and not only pull it up and outwards so there are many techniques of massage and this is the technique which i have been using for many years and that's why i you don't see any wrinkles you don't have to spend any money just quality time to your massage some a uh, nice uh, cream or moisturizer or uh, anything whichever you like so let me tell you uh, the uh, first is you can take your two fingers if you uh, like it or if you have long nails and you think that it might hurt your skin because of the nails you can start to do massage with this way also so let me tell you how it goes because most of the blood veins that goes to face comes from here so we will start initially warming up a uh, massage to the neck so that you are you don't get wrinkles in the neck so most of the people who grow old first start the wrinkles here you will see skin sagging here so how you are going to do is first you massage like this like this upward 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 because of the gravitational most of the skin goes down like this start to curve down so you have to push it up push it up i will show all the techniques once please don't do it once you can do as many times as you like because ma massage is natural there is no chemicals and nothing all you are doing is massage you increase the blood circulation to the face then you hold like this upward 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 movement upward 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 movement and this is the throat you can do like this let me tell you once i had lot of problem with my cough sinus common cold and i had to go to doctor to take antibiotics and all and uh, someone told me that you don't have to waste your money you don't need a uh, five day course to solve all you have to do is you take your finger and massage here after every half an hour for five minutes and trust me it worked you know every hour i massage this area of my throat for five minutes and guess what within one day i was relieved because most of the time it takes when you take antibiotic it takes 5 days and trust me i just massaged this place because i had cough very bad cough 
So I massaged every hour, five minutes like this. And within a day, my cough disappeared. Yes, it works. Trust me, nothing. You don't have to take uh, any antibiotics which have side effects. And uh, I know something when you take too much of uh, antibiotic you end up with having a super bug so the best thing is just take your fingers every hour massage here this is the technique which I have used and it worked for me and many of my friends also when I told them this idea and they tried it and they said oh it works okay so this is how you do you pull upward 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 massage to your face and back this back here here the neck area this is the place where you have pain when you have a lot of stress and tension this is the place exactly here here can you see this is the place where you have to massage you will might have some pain if you have a lot of stress and tension and this will relieve you of tension okay now you have to take like this and do like this upward 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 movement upward if you have long knees and you are not sure about uh, hurting yourself with your nails you can do like this what is important is it's always upward and outward movement of your hands okay so then you have to think about here you have to take two fingers like this like this like this and upward and outward movement upward and outward movement upward and if you think you have long knees you don't want to hurt upward upward and outward upward and outward what you're doing is you don't want to skin sag okay then you are going to take two fingers now like this like this like this like this then like this like this upward and outward movement long lace people can do like this like this like this now here like this like this i'm going to do only once or twice you do it more times no harm and if you have, have uh, cheeks you can do like this also circular motion here circular motion here circular and then here like this like this if you have long knees like this like this like this like this upward and outward movements now your nose nose like this like this there are many pressure points on your face in my next video if i have time i will tell about the pressure points the right pressure point in your face which will help you to have a glowing skin and well as well as some of the pressure point for the diseases that can be resolved without any medicine holistic medicine and then here you do it here 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 so you do it all the nose now your eyes so you take your there is tear duct here here tear duct don't press hard softly press and then you do upward and outward movement like this i'm doing it once or twice do it more times and then you do here massage it upward and outward movement and you know there is tension uh, this is the point where you have to do like this you when you are stressed and all this is the best place just to get relaxed and after massaging you can do like this wiggle here massaging here wiggle here massage here and wiggle so they uh, these your eyes will uh, get good circulation and of course some people want their eyeballs to look beautiful and shiny you know when you look at a person if you have a shiny eyeball you love it so what you have to do you have to take the tip of your eyes 
do circular motion you know where is your eyeball clockwise anti clockwise this year i do it 20 to 30 times and i'm telling you it works your eyes will have uh, your eyes will never become dry and your eyeballs will have a natural glow which will look very beautiful because eyes is the beautiful part of our face and all you have to do is 10 to 20 30, uh, 30 times just soft don't be too hard just do like this near the eyeball and you will have a glowing eyeballs which will attract anyone when you have a glowing eyeballs now i am going to the forehead this is the ajna chakra third eye this is the place where you will massage to relax when you're stressed and all this is the place where you might get wrinkles so just massage like this and now again i'm showing you upward and outward upward and outward upward and outward upward and outward medicine then like this upward only upward movements never down okay and then you have to do about your eyebrows eyebrows like this hold your this and do about your eyebrows eyebrows like this like this and like this so let me tell you one some more good uh, pressure points the best pressure one behind your ears take your finger behind your eye mark as if like this this is you have many pressure points behind your ears exactly here if you massage here some suppose you have some problem somewhere in other areas also they are connected interconnected there are pressure points just behind your ears just mark the outline of your ears like this this will help a lot because multiple pressure points are activated here okay so as you age when you grow old your eyes start to go in in because you don't want to happen that your eyes should be always normal what you do is massage here for two minutes and two like this and then hold your eyes like this actually you are creating a vacuum natural vacuum here here and pull your eyes outward like this you can create a vacuum here this actually i do it mostly in the restroom you know what i mean when i'm doing important things of the day all i do is sit and do like this there is a vacuum here your eyes will start to shine naturally you're creating an, a natural vacuum and you're pulling your eyes out this the, when you have oil it doesn't work that good but yes when you ha have a dry eye and dry a hand you can work it out this works best on your eyes like this it will pull your eyes out and you will have a glowing eyes always so these are the massage techniques which work for me which will work for anyone because but just don't do anything like this it's always like this it always has to go up and outward movement and then your lips also so these are the techniques which worked for me which works for most of the people just massage every day for 10 minutes you don't have to uh, need any other things just massage will make your face glow and please if you love this uh, video please subscribe to my channel and say thumbs up for this uh, cost effective way of getting a glowing skin thank you thank you for your time i really appreciate